What was that? Hey there, Gonzalez. How's it going? Me? I'm doing a little research. Hey, speaking of which, ever heard of the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? Nope. Yeah, this place has lumens and secrets and spades, but the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pits are the most mysterious of the bunch. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Well, so how about it? Want to hear about the Seven Wonders or not? Maybe? Grubba and Jolene? Grubba's a strange one. His body's inc incredibly toned, even though he's past 60. He must have an exceptional training regimen. Then there's the matter of Miss Jolene. They say she suddenly vanishes at times. Some say a fighter saw her go into the bathroom and waited for her to come out. But she never did. Huh? You think it's stranger than someone staked out her bathroom? Good point. Yeah. Anything else you want to hear about? The missing ones. They say sometimes fighters disappear for no reason, never to return. Some say that the very first champion, Prince Mush, was spirited away in this way. Oh, Prince Mush. He's been called back. Anything else you want to hear about? My friend's friend's friend told me this one. He said he just saw a strange light leaking under the ring doors when no one was there. He couldn't see inside since the doors were locked. I plan to investigate this myself. Okay. They say that the champion's room is haunted. Some say if you keep still in the room, you'll hear voices whispering from nowhere. Some even say the voices are athletes who stopped, who lost to the champion. Anything else you want to hear about? The stairs. They say there's a room in the glitz pit with a second floor, but with no stairs. They say no one has ever gone upstairs. And some say that groaning voices sometimes come from that second floor. Interesting. The man-eating toilet? They say in one of the arena's bathrooms, a man-eating toilet lurks. Some say that anyone who sees this toilet will never see anything again. And the sealed wall? They say there's a sealed wall in the minor league locker room. Some say that remains of fallen athletes are stored in there. Huh. You know, it's possible that the seven runners are just gossip and rumors. But I've got to tell you, I think they're real. And I think they're sketchy. I smell a rat behind all of this. And someday, I'll solve all of these mysteries. Hey, if you ever want to hear whatever, whatever. Where's the bathroom? Like, they're mentioning a bathroom, so I assume there's a bathroom somewhere around here, you know? Wall leak. What's the symbolism? Oh, okay. Is there no bathroom around here? Oh, what's going on? Oh, it's the hawk! Hey, hawk! Ha 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 ha, everyone wants a piece of the rock. It's a tough life. Here's a little free advice. Try to be me, yeah? Because everyone loves to be rock. Ah, I can hit him all the way. That's funny. Gotta use this as one of the thumbnails. Can I just hit them all the way? It is decreasing, I think. No way. I hit everybody away. Hey, you, that ain't cool. Don't beat on my fans just because you ain't got none. Huh? The Great Gonzalez? I don't cover minor leaguers. Clear out of the way. Move aside, you wanna be. Okay, whatever. I don't see no bathroom. <laughs> You ever watch minor league fights? I do. You sometimes find diamonds in the rough. Okay, Lily can't move anywhere here though, huh? From the looks of it, no. Not even as paper. <laughs> what about you? How you doing, bud? I'm a freelance, whatever. Oh, that dude's gone. Oh, this is the main stage. I still can't move at all though. Let's see. I went through the wrong way, huh? I should have gone through the other door. And I've been wanting to sneeze for like the entire stream and it has just not come out. I'm like here having the feeling that I want to sneeze. But just nothing. Oh, it might be through that rock, that that big block, huh? But I can't break that yet. Oh, dizzy dial. I have a good feeling that the secret that they're talking about is probably through this. But I can't break this yet. Anyways. Okay then, the next opponent is Spike Storm. Avoid swapping partners. Uh, how g fine Goombella works. Come on, let's go. Oh, it's the uh, that's not who I thought it was. I thought it was like the spiny, the spike, the spike fuzzballs. I don't know what they're called. Fuzzies. <laughs> the Midnight Spike Bombers. Yep, a fight with the Spike Storm. We aren't gonna lose to the likes of you. We're gonna spike bomb you into submission, punks. Okay, so definitely Goombella, because I can tattle them. Get their info for the future. So tattle on the spinies. Perfect, that's a spiny. I can one-shot them, probably. So when you... 
Their defense dropped to zero. Oh, huh. interesting. I c maybe I can do some with this though. I want to. I want to try it. Damn, I did nothing, huh? Okay, I guess the pow block might still be the best way to go. Sorry, Goombella. No way, another one. Okay. Um, Tattle, please, on Lakitu. That's a Lakitu. It's a member of the Koopa clan that rides on clouds. If you stomp on it while holding a... Yeah. Where does it keep all those spiny eggs? I should have paid more attention to what it was talking about about these things. I heard Pow Block, though. So, it flips shelled enemies, which is probably the best thing. There you go. Oh, they still just flip back up. <laughs> Defend. I should have swapped it. Ah, whatever. Let's just do this, just so I don't need to worry about it. The, the spinies are a little bit funny to kill. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. Now they're all dead. No way they're surviving that, right? Yep. Go team! Alright, see? No biggie. You're right. So that was harder than the usual ones. Your rank went up. Now, if you'll excuse me, you say the same thing over and over again. Hey man, check this. I heard the hot dog stand outside is getting a new menu item. I use a mystic egg. Did you know? The hot dog can restore your HP and FP during a match. That's some serious nutrition. I'm not sponsored. Yet. Just excited about some probably amazing hot dogs. You have to snack out on one. Yeah, I have like three on me. <laughs> I'll go check out that hot dog. Why not? And then the rock hawk is gone. He did not come back after that. No, stop that at once. This behavior is unacceptable. In a food stuff, I insist you desist. Oh my god, the egg's running away. <laughs> That's funny. No, please come back to me. Someone help. My rare imported egg has escaped. Please catch it. How am I supposed to catch it? Hey, you. You, no. Ah. Hit it. <laughs> okay. I know how to get up there, though. Absolutely unacceptable in a polite society. I insist you come down at once, egg. How am I to reach you up there? Fly? Like a common sparrow? Okay. So some, definitely something's alive in there. So it probably wouldn't be the best thing if you ate it. Wait. There is a shine thing over there. How do I get that? Yeah, I know. But like, how do I get this thing? Like this? No. Because like, I, I see that there's a... A whatchamacallit. But I can't get to it. So. I don't know. Let's go. Fly. Don't undershoot, please. Hello, Mr. Egg. Huh? Did you hear that, Mario? You don't want to be eaten, little eggy weggy? <laughs> it's so adorable. What should we do, Mario? Should we help it? Let there be hot dog. <laughs> no, help the little guy. Well, if you're going to say that, Mario, then I guess we should help. What, were you going to go after the hot dog? Mr. Hot Dog Stand Guy, it looks like the egg doesn't want to be eaten. It's okay to let it go, right? Oh, very well, fine. I suppose there's not much market for cuisine that jumps so anyway. Awesome! Did you hear that, little Eggy Weggy? You're free! See you around. Aw. Huh? What is it now, Eggy? You wanna follow us? Is that it? I'm pretty sure our little buddy here wants to ta hang out with us. Did we let it? Okay, sure. You hear that, little Egg? Just make sure not to get in our way, though, okay? He's gonna get, like, hit somehow, and then he breaks out of the shell or something. I have no idea. Gotta be a way to get over there, though, right? That, uh... Time sprite underneath? You guys gotta be, right? The egg is funny though. I like it. This isn't gonna work, huh? Okay, whatever. Let's just leave. I guess more battles? Let me save. What is going on? Are you excited, little eggy? I have no idea. Great match! Looking for a fight, huh? Next opponent is... The Handed Overs. I want you to avoid using any of them their flower points. Okay. That's a bit more difficult, but okay. I mean, I can use star points. That wouldn't be against the rules, you know. Oh, it's these guys? The Grim Death Burglars? Yep. And the Handed Overs. 
Come on, Mario. You got this. We're awfully quick, awfully agile, and just plain awful. Okay, whatever, dudes. Don't use FP, but I can just appeal. Then tattle. Bandit and Big Bandit, they look the exact same. What do you mean, Big Bandit? 5 HP, that's a decent amount of HP, damn. The luck on a bandit's face when he guards, it effectively is priceless. Let's guard it. Haha, -ha. aww, he gets sad. <laughs> that's the face. Poor guy, he just gets sad, that's kind of funny. I feel bad for the guy. 8 HP, damn, that is a lot. You chill blow by without stealing anything. If he robbed you, you won't get your items back unless you beat him right then. He'll run. Man, that kind of sucks. Appeal one more time. And I gotta make sure to do to dodge everything. Good. Good. Two more. Good. I did a lot more damage, though. I gotta move Goombella out of here. Sorry, Goombella. Okay, Earth Tremor. One. Two. Three, four, now like five more times. One more, one more. Perfect. I think it's not gonna kill the last guys, but it'll be close. Yeah, they still survived just a little bit. Um, I can do it. Perfect. There's one left. Now I am going to tactic appeal so I can gain a little bit more of my star power back. And then finish him off with a normal hammer. Oh my god, are you really giving me a stat buff now? I do not need this right now. At least I'm guaranteed to kill him. I'm finally leveling up. Give me that more bad points. Thank you very much. Oh, and it refilled my star power. How nice. I'm 14. I have a couple more to go until I'm at, you know, the Major League. Did you hear the latest G-Man? My boy said that we saw a stunning babe having the juice at the fresh juice shop. She likes juice, I like juice, we already have so much in common. Check her out for me, man. Yeah, she definitely seemed interested. The badges, I got three more now. I could get more max HP. I don't know what to wear. I might just use HP plus, to be honest. Uh, there's nothing I specifically want to turn on right now. But, I mean, more health is always nice. Let's go! So my next opponent is... The Mind Bogglers. And I want you to avoid using any of them special moves. Okay. I guess. I assume by special moves it means the SP ones? Ow. I'm on it. Or should I say Eggy Weggy? The Grey Entanglers. The mind bogglers. They're just dudes from the woods. Boggly woods. So no specials, right? Which would mean none from this tab. But everything else is on the table. Why did I do that? I'm realizing now that that was kind of dumb. I'm gonna head bonk this guy. I cannot time that move. I'm just really bad at timing that move for some reason. No rocks, please. <laughs> Damn, just hammered them. Oh, that was an x knot. You think they're catching on? Go Mario. I guess for the Piter. I cannot time that move. Like, it is so hard to time. Now just the Piter is left. Finally, I actually did it. My bad, Goombella. What? Please don't go for me. No! Good. <laughs> for Goombella, that was close. Easy. Alright. He no biggie. 13. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now if you excuse me, I must be going. Listen man, keep it under your hat, but I'm thinking about retiring soon. If I stay any longer, well, my future might get shorter, you know? So after my next match, I'm gone. It ain't cool to quit and run, that's for sure. But you know what? That's life, double G, man. Listen, you stay cool, okay? Promise me you won't ever forget you once knew. K and K. Okay, King Kong. I'll make sure you're remembered. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? It is... The Punk Rocks. I want you to use at least one special move. Okay, sure. I'm just gonna go right off the bat and use Rock Tremor. The Green Torture Squad. A fight to the finish with the Punk Rocks. It's just these guys. This'll be easy. So I do wonder why they're green. Alright, 
first just tattle. Okay, they're dead for sure. Body is rock hard. I think that's not gonna matter too much though. I'm too ghost special. Earth Tremor. Beat them up. And just like that, they're all gonna die. I assume. I think. Yeah, they're dead. Cool. <laughs> Easy. The Great Gonzalez. See, no biggie. How many fights are left? 12. So, like, two more? Is King K gone already? Aw. King K's gone. I'm gonna miss him. I hope we find him somewhere else one day. Alright, ranked again. Ranked 11, the bob -omb Squad. Now listen, son. I want you to wrap it up in five turns or less. Got it. I got a date with my best gal in just a few and I don't want to be late. Okay, whatever. I'll kill him in less. The, the big bomb bombers. Boomers? Bombers? Boomers? I don't know. <laughs> so what he wants us to do is to beat him up in less than five moves. Which should be easy, though I will start off by tattling just so I can see their stats. But if they're normal, I could probably just kill them with a quake hammer. 4 HP, 1 defense. Maybe. I might need 2 moves. But I can definitely, uh... It'll blow up at the slightest combat. Okay, that's nice. I'm still just gonna do Quake Hammer. That'll probably be my best bet. So close. Now everybody's mad. And Goombella's like at the front. All the punies ran away. Damn. Damn. They weren't kidding, huh? They were, they are really, really mad. Yeah, Goombella died. And she's back alive. That one's wasted, t to be honest. He's okay. She's gonna finish him off. Though that wasn't the best idea, but it did finish him off. <laughs> that, if I could only do like one more damage, I could have just beat him all up before that. <laughs> but oh well. I'm almost 10. You have one more fight to go. And then we can leave the minor league. It's quite lonely without King K around. Bomb. No lonely. Him too weak. Now him not here. Sound normal to Cleffer. You are in bomb denial, Clefter. I saw you weeping in that locker, Bomb Bomb. The weird men at your house. What weird men at your house? Well, here we are. This is your locker room. You're standing in the minor league, of course, as you've just started your career. If you don't like the singing room, I suggest you work your way up through the ranks. When you're ready to fight, why, why are we getting all the same information? They are doing check on the house. Oh, okay. Well, get ready whenever you can. The Goomba Bros. A triple flip and meow. Okay. That better not be my next one. No way, really? That's gonna be so much fun. We do not need to get the entire introduction. Like, why is it explaining everything? <laughs> if you get your rank up to 11th, you'll get a shot at the Major League. Thanks. That's the only part of the information that I might need. I guess. Hi, guys. Yeah, my name's Swoop. Sir Swoop. I mean, nice to meet you. You, yes you, Miss Sir Swoop. It's time for your battle, bub. Follow me. Okay, let me get Goombella healed up. That last fight was explosive. <laughs> oh yeah, we got an egg. I think you missed that part. He's our buddy. We have a little child now. He was adopted from off the streets. What? One of my guy friends was cheating on their girlfriend with an online affair and the online person turned out to be a man. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Your next opponent is the Iron Aiden Twins. That's right. You're finally gonna go to the major league, son. We're expecting great things from you. So don't you go on letting us down now. Yeah, I can tell that backfire. That does not sound nice. Be sure to use a partner skill at least once. Got it. I'm going to use the tattle. What? Why? Like that's way too much. I wouldn't even send I wouldn't even send you two hundred bucks. <laughs> okay, but that's like two hundred bucks. <laughs> that's still a lot of money. Gonzalez, don't you dare lose, dude. Well, like if you're just asking for it, I don't know. It depends on what it is for. Who we, the great Gonzalez? How are you feeling? Okay, I guess just perfect. Thanks, like a doof. Just perfect. 
Damn, okay. <laughs> well, Nelly, you heard that, fella, folks. He's obviously itching to mix it up some. Oh, it's these guys? Oh, God, no. That's actually kind of bad for me. I should have maybe gotten uh, another pow block. Your challenger is real confident, boys. Yup, he's talking trash. Iron Aiden twins, he said more like paper dog face bros, and they stink. And then he said, I bet they just play video games and cry when they lose. Um, yeah, and then he said, Audi belly buttons run in their family, stink quads, okay, and so on. Yup. What? How does he know my mom has an Audi? That jerk. <laughs> we're gonna blend you up into a smoothie, pal, and then we're gonna drink ya. Anyway, he was a sugar daddy for this girl for months. That's good on the dude. Good on the dude. The one that got the money. He's making it rich. Only smelling stinkwads call other people stinkwads. Understand, stinkwad? Simmer down there, bro. You stinkwad. You're gonna regret opening your yap, pal. See these bods? Solid iron. See these pikes? Yeah, they penetrate any substance. But basically, what I'm telling you is that whatever you try will be completely useless. Think that over in the very short time you have left with your functioning brain. Sent the guy over like $2,000? That's so much. <laughs> That's... Damn. How did he not know? How did he get that far into it without knowing? We're gonna do it. We'll make the major league if we win. Get psyched. Yeah, I would imagine. Well, Stinkwaz, you're about to learn about our skills the hard way. Use a partner move at least once. Obviously, I'm gonna. I'm gonna tattle right now. 6 HP. Unknown defense. That's an iron cleft. That guy is scary, period. Max HP is 6. Attack is 4. And defense is unknown. What's with this book? It says no attacks will work against iron cleft. It says nothing in the world is as hard as an iron cleft. So its defense is impenetrable. If that's true, the only way to beat one is to thwack it with the other one. Running away may not be a bad idea at this point. How am I supposed to thwack it with the other one? I'm gonna defend, I guess. Poor dude. I have other stuff to tell you. Can't wait. Damn, they already beat up poor Goombella. I should probably switch him. Just heal, I guess. <laughs> I'd rather her not die. Okay, now I need you to tattle on the other one. That's an iron cleft the green shoes mean. This one must be the younger brother. Okay, <laughs> Luigi. Max HP is sick, defense is unknown still. It said no attack will work against Iron Cleft. It said nothing in the world is as hard as an Iron Cleft, so its defense is impenetrable. If that's true, the only way to beat one is to whack it with the other one. What would you wear to make your boyfriend really happy? I have no idea. Um, sundress, I don't know, not really. Running away may not be a bad idea at this point. Did I actually run away? A skirt for sure. Damn it, I missed. Can I run away? It's literally saying maybe running away would not be a bad idea. I'll try. What happens if I actually run away? Wait, what? Oh. Did I do it? Oh, I just get beat up. We tried to tell you, but no. If you want another piece of pummel cake, have a bath and come back. Okay. So that just... Maybe running away wasn't the thing I needed to do. Your rank will remain at 11 because you lost. The combination of working? Why is that? Hey, check it out. Our little eggy friend is gone. Didn't see that coming. Or going, for that matter. Where do you think it went? I don't know. Yo! It's a blue Yoshi! Gonzalez! Check me out. Thanks to you, I hatched safe and sound. Thanks, man. I don't. What? You were in that little, cute little eggy weggy? Whoa, that's wild. Yeah, but who cares? You guys want to be champs, right? You want a crystal star? Anyway, I gotta repay you for saving me from old Hoggle out there. So I'll fight for you. I can hold my own. I'll swallow my own, any opponent whole. Honest. You leave it to me. Huh? My name? Let me see. I just came out of that egg, so I guess I don't have one yet. You can fire it up about it. So why don't you give me one? Make it cool, okay? Yeah, it's a Game Boy on the wall. Does the Yoshi have a name? What is Yoshi's legal name? That's not what I meant. I guess not official. Canon name. There is no canon name for the Yoshi? Oh. I'm not gonna name him Poopy. Or wait, Poppy? Oh. Well, I'm not... <laughs> I wanted to call him Eggy. Because Goombella kept on calling him Eggy Weggy. 
I think Eggie's cool. Because he's Eggie. He has an egg on him. He's Eggie. Not too bad, dude. Not too bad at all. Yeah, I like it. Okay, Gonzalez, let's get out there and do some damage. The Yoshi is now your friend. He'll answer to Eggie. Yoshi's abilities. X to ride Yoshi. Cool. You can move faster while riding Yoshi. Ooh. I can also kind of hover. While jumping A, hold A to float through the air for a brief time. Okay, so I can... I don't jump. I just kind of hover. Interesting. I've mastered them. I get it. He can repeatedly bounce on enemies using his brown pound move or use gulp to inhale enemies whole and spit them out for massive damage. Okay. I assume I gotta use that, maybe? 